Well, hey, Fierce Nation, here we are at headquarters. We've got, uh, it's a pretty cool day here. We've got the new Reaper. It's been on our website for sale for quite a while, but this is the first one. We finally have it perfected. It's how we like it. Um, if you can see, we went with a different carbon, our car, C3 carbon barrels, we went with a different finish on, on the outside, kind of a, a matrix look. Um, has Doesn't have the finished cloth like the hangar, just kind of random, a random look to it. Looks pretty cool. Um, in the back, the buffer tube is the same way here. So match those up. And then of course the handguard has our standard carbon fiber look. And the back end of the Reaper is all carbon fiber, this whole section. So it's very high tech. No other chassis out there that we've seen has, uh, you know, these type of components in the back end, front end, extremely lightweight. And then it's comes in a fixed version where the stock is fixed or this folding version. This one's a folder. So if you're backpacking, you're gonna have that lightweight uh, compact function so you can fold it up, put it in your backpack so your gun's not sticking above your head. It's pretty cool. We're gonna try that out in the mountains of New Mexico this week and see how it does. But uh, then the aluminum chassis here, of course it's got the same Bix and Andy trigger, extremely lightweight, uh, adjustable. Our rival action and uh, this one's topped with a with a Zeiss and I've got a, a titanium suppressor on the end so this whole package with a with a bipod just light and handy um, man we're, we're very impressed with with ourselves we feel like we did a great job here I'm just gonna dial this in I'm gonna take it out for its inaugural run out here on the Muscalero for elk this is chambered in a 300 PRC from uh, one of Hornady's calibers of course, we're shooting their ammo in, uh, I'm going to be shooting the 225 and see how that performs on a big old bull this, this next week. So I'm just going to side it in, zero it at 200, take it out to range, and uh, I think we're going to be ready for some elk hunting. But the new Reaper, man, if you don't have one, get one. Get one on order through your local dealer, call us direct, or if you have one on order, they're starting to ship. So that's the good news. Bingo. Try one at 500. I think with my eyes. Get my ammo a hold. 500 yards. Bingo. 5.9 MOA. Or actually, down my turret right there. Gotta find the play. There it is. 500 yard plate, make sure I'm level. Here we go. Bingo. This thing's ready for the hunt, man. We got Minute of Elk. The new Reaper from Fierce, check it out. This week's hunt, we're to the Muscalera 2021. As you saw last week, Gage shot a great management bull from this hunt, and now I'm after trophy bulls. I'm taking our new Reaper rifle on its inaugural run. We're taking it out to field test it for big bulls. So stay with us, let's see if we can get it done. Well, here we are, first, first evening in the hunt this morning. Uh, Bulls bugling already. This morning, Gage already got her done. As you saw, the footage made a great shot. Now, I get to be greedy. We can just focus on me. So we're looking for a trophy bull, Kevin. Uh, has a trail cam set up on this pond right here. There's a couple good looking bulls on there. Mm -hmm. And we've pulled up. It's early, it's hot. It's, dang, it's gotta be 70, 75 degrees. It's warm. We've already got bulls bugling off here in the background, so. We're gonna we're gonna get our gear and get after it. So that's another that's the typical plan here. So let's go get them. So 
So as you've seen over the years, I've hunted on the Muscalero for elk, and usually we like to hunt here as much as we can. We hunt, it's a five day hunt. We usually will shop and look for bulls for three or four days before we usually pull the trigger. But on this hunt, it happened fast. We got in the trees, Gage saw a big bull with a big back end whale tail, which actually the last few years has really been lacking. So when we see a bull with a big fifth and sixth, it gets us excited. And that's exactly what happened here. Check it out. Right there to the left. Same clear. Going. Where? Where? Come here. Come here. Grab that stick. We got through that thick stuff, but I saw his back end, and that's I'm pretty sure that's the same bull right there. Dude, I saw his back end, he's freaking huge. I don't know about the front, yeah. His ones and twos look decent. I never saw his third, but his back end's got that big split. <laughs> there he is, <laughs> man. Look at that back end. Oh, that fifth and sixth is what got him done. Nice, he's done, bud. Oh, boom. Muscalero right here. Can't believe this, this is a first day bull. Look at that thing. Well, here we are on the Muscalero first evening of the hunt. As you just uh, saw what happened, we, we were checking trail cams tonight with Kevin. Our guide has uh, some trail cams up along the tops here. In the top, in the parks up here, there's some nice little ponds and some openings, but once you go into the trees, it's thick. And uh, we were checking, just driving and oh, checking and heard a bugle. And look at this bull. His, uh, this is one of the biggest whale tails I've ever seen out here on the Muscalero. So that back end, I saw that and immediately thought he's a shooter. And uh, you know, good solid bull. Uh, that whale tail got him shot. That is just a giant fifth and six right there. Um, shooting the Reaper. The Reaper made its uh, maiden voyage and, and performed perfect. First shot drilled him. I was shooting through a little bit of brush, probably at about 150 yards maybe is all. But uh, we knew he, we hit him and we walked up here and uh, he was down, man. So Muscalero Madness, first day. You got your five by and now we got this big six. So now what do we do? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know that we've ever been, been done this early. I don't know that we've ever been finished with both the trophy and the management on the first day, but beautiful bull, great experience. We love it out here. And the Reaper, man, it uh, I was very impressed with it. Lightweight, um, shot like a dream and got it pulled down. So good stuff. Come on. 